Hello and welcome to another reaction review video with me, Nina Schofield, singer-songwriter, vocal coach and session musician and I unfortunately could not go to the latest Dimash concerts in Dubai but I did spot this video of Stranger and live from the concert and I knew that I had to watch it and watch it with you all and just see what happened. It feels like we're so lucky these days to be able to get these snapshots of things from events that we can't go to. And this one in particular, I'm just really, really interested, interested to see how he staged this and the overall kind of effect of Stranger uh, being sung at this concert. And I can't wait to watch and watch with you and let's see what goes on in this video. Are you ready? Here we go. sound is so earthy, so grounding, I feel. And then the kind of military bump, ba -da -da -dun, da -da -da -dun. it's so cinematic. I love the blue that he's wearing, very striking, isn't it? Oh, the push on that one note. It's so aspirate, this vocal. See, when he says that, you have that lovely uh, reverb and the sort of delay and it makes everything shimmer. And then at the same time, you have the kind of glistening sound effects going on. So it really, everything makes sense uh, placement wise. Love those chord changes. Listen to the clarity there and those delays. <laughs> it's so dramatic. And yet only two people on stage. Oh, so bassy. It's his lower register that now takes me by surprise. You know when you first listen to Dimash and his higher register makes you go, what? Now when I listen to him and we go down into these lower parts and it's so superbly done, you, oh, it just blows my mind. You can't help but be taken with vocals like this. <laughs> It's such a well-written song as well, the way it raises here. That vocal punches through. in his vocal tone when he has that connection it's like his voice was built for stadium type performances I feel and it's really interesting to watch it from this perspective as an audience member in a way uh, to and even just getting this snapshot where it's just this frame that we can see we can't see the whole thing 
um, but you really start to get the sense of how his vocal just sweeps across a stadium and envelops the whole thing. I love that we have the contrast between the high and the low unison instrumental here. <laughs> Even his movements suit that vocal. Oh! Wow! So good at performing, isn't he? <laughs> that vibrato. Again, I feel like I'm starting to take it for granted, but we mustn't forget that he goes from these super high vocals way down into the low ones in real quick succession. We mustn't forget. It's like a call and response between his vocal and the instrumental. Whoa! Listen to the cry in his vocal now. I really enjoy about the way this song is written as well as we don't have gaps between the melody at this point it's like da, 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 da. you know you could almost hear in your head it being sung like da, 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 da. two three four strangers in a foreign land but no we just keep going keep going push into that next phrase and I, I love that, that it keeps the momentum of the song going. It's almost more impressive than with the breath control. Oh, the chord change. Very good. <laughs> I really, really enjoyed that, especially that last part. I don't know, there's something about the ends of songs, especially when they're sung by someone like Dimash, where it just gets you in the feels, as they say. And he has such an incredible way of performing his performance technique. Vocal aside, his performance technique is so impressive and so exciting and, and enthralling and exhilarating that you can't help but be swept up in the moment. Um, I just wish I could have been there in person. Did any of you get the chance to attend or have you in the past attended one of Dimash's concerts? Let me know in the comments box down below and let me know what you thought of this kind of fan cam uh, version of Stranger as well. And as always, if you enjoyed this video, then feel free to hit that subscribe button, become part of the family here, me and Monster and Pucklesworth. And you can of course find me on Twitter and Instagram at Nina underscore Schofield. And you can find links to all my various services, including my Wizio. I can help you out with your singing and answer any questions you might have for me with a personalised video response. Um, I've really been enjoying working with you all recently. Uh, the link to that is in the description box down below, alongside links to my Patreon, my own music, lots of stuff. And I hope you have a lovely rest of your day and I'll see you on the next video. Love you. Bye.